Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate. Let's continue on exploring around. Um, I haven't seen a bridge, so unless there's a bridge down here, I'm not, I'm not sure how to get over to the other side. Then again, there might not be anything on the other side, so... Who knows? Uh, why am I getting some slowdown? It seems a little bit better now. Why can't we walk on the shore? That's very strange. Do 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 do. There we go. Some more zombies. Oh, my heart's really not in this. I wonder if we find out who is creating them or not. I mean, I wonder if we'll find out who is creating them. <clears throat> Someone's got to be creating them. Do 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 do. All right. Let's see. A little bit left to explore. But if we don't find any more zombies, then that's probably uh, 20. Go talk to the uh, farmer. See if that is the case. And then we might just head into Baldur's Gate itself. Killing zombies for fun and profit. Whee! Alright, where were you? You were over here. Alright, come on, people. There we go. Hello, pal. Thanks, that's been real generous of you. Maybe we all can finally get a wink of sleep yet. Here's that 150 we promised you. If we had some more, we'd give some to you. Eh, don't worry about it. I had 800 experience points out of it, so that's not too bad. Oh, he took some damage. Wow. Now, let's see. Where is the... There we go. Dump that on me, and... Dump that on me. Let's see if we can figure out what these are. Nope. Nope. Okay. Identify with the spell. Cloak of Protection plus one. I wonder if there's anyone who can use that. No. It's not going to work with him, is it? Yeah. Did not think so. Alright, let's see if she has space. Yes, she does. Can you figure out what it is? Nope, but we'll identify it. Okay, what are you wearing? It's a cloak of displacement. Ah, that's right. That is... Cloak of non-detection. Cloak of the wolf. That's plate mail plus one, so that's not going to work. Full plate mail. <clears throat> huh. Alright, well. I guess we'll just sell it. Just not much else I to do with here. it. Your concern? Well, I don't see any bridges, so I guess we'll just uh, head down done. this way and. And cross. Or, not cross, but head down to uh, Baldur's Gate. Finally! I suppose it's about time that we finally get to the namesake of the game. Come on, everyone. Hurry up. Hurry the hell up. Ah, oh, so slow.
Okay. Now we can leave. Whee! Let's see which side we end up on. It will magically teleport to the other side. Yes, we magically teleported to the other side. Woohoo! It is done. Alrighty, well, let's go ahead and uh, cross the bridge. Do 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 do. Heading into Baldur's Gate. Whee! Or many people. You'd think that there'd be more people coming in and out, but apparently not. This is a really big bridge, too. I serve the flaming fist. Good for you. The entrance tax is six gold pieces for each party of travelers. Please announce your point of origin. Mystical land of frolicky naked nymphs, where your every desire is granted by bald, blubbering bugbears. <laughs> oh, I want to. I want to. Can't keep. You'll have to wait here. My commander wishes to have a word with you. Citizens, please step forward. First off, let me introduce myself. I'm Scar. Second in command of the Flaming Fist. Though it is not necessary for you to re reveal your names, please answer me this. Are you the group that was involved in the fiasco at the Nashkill Mines? Yes, that was us. Well, I'll have to say, you've made quite the commotion up here in Baldur's Gate. I can't really put my finger on a single source, but there have been many strange happenings going on within the city. It's been getting harder and harder for me to put trust in someone. I need outsiders to do some investigations. People with no connections to anyone within the city. Would you be interested in working for me in such a capacity? <clears throat> if it pays well, sure. Alright then. What I'm about to tell you is must be held in the strictest confidence. Do you understand? I need you to begin an investigation of the Seven Suns trading coster. The Seven Suns leadership has been acting strangely of late. They've been selling off valuable assets and neglecting many of their m more profitable trading ventures. Considering the importance of that of the trading coster, uh, con considering the importance that the trading coster holds over the economy of the city, the Grand Dukes are noticeably upset. I've gone to talk to the coaster's head, Josso. He rudely rebuffed me, telling me to mind my own business. I've known Josso for many years, and this isn't his usual behavior. I can't start up an official investigation, as there is no real reason for doing so. That's why I need you. Um, boom, boom, boom. Yeah. We're ready to go for it, but there's something that you need to know first. We think that the Iron Throne may be behind recent events along the coast. At the mines in Nashkel and in Cloak in and in Cloakwood, we've learned about we've learned much about the goals and methods of the Iron Throne, and it doesn't bode well for the future of this region. Well that shed sheds new light on things. There's nothing I can really do about it now, but I'll make sure to look into it. I want you to break into the Seven Suns compound. Sweet! Legalized thievery! Yes. I want you to break into the Seven Suns compound and find out what's wrong. Use stealth in your investigations. I don't want this operation to cause too much fuss. The most important person to watch for is Jasso. Once you've found out as much as possible, report back to me at the Flaming Fist compound. I'll pay you 2,000 gold for this favor. Sweet! 2,000 more gold to add to our 43, uh, 46,000 that we currently have. I hope you'll at least give me experience points, too. The estate is located on the southwest side of the city. I wish all of you the best of luck. Remember, once you're done in the Seven Sun, at the Seven Suns estate, it's imperative that you meet me at the Flaming Fist Barracks, which are just west of the Seven Suns. Sweet! 
<clears throat> Legalized thievery. So awesome. Sorry, I'm still a little... Uh, still got the cold. Still stuffed up. And a little phlegmy. Let's see if there's anything on uh, outside of the walls here. Anything at all? Do, 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 do. Let's take a look at the map. Yeah, we really moved up pretty far there. Well, uh, so we've got that to do. Uh, we also have to go uh, uh, find those uh, sea charts. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that uh, we've been told to do here, other than, of course, figuring out what the heck is up with the Iron Throne here. And I'm sure there's been some things that I, that are in my journal that I should probably go check, but I'm not actually going to go check, because I'm lazy. All right, there's nothing off that side that we can go to. I mean, I'm sure I'll find find everything out eventually. I'll just talk to everyone who has a name. It's usually a good idea. Is that an animal? That's an animal. That's a chicken. Who is this? Quail! That name sounds familiar. Walking alone in the Coastway Road. How smart is this? Very smart, actually. Hey ho there, fellow travelers. You look to be wander wanderers of the adventuring sort. Tell me, what direction calls you? Um, doo -doo -doo. um, I guess northerly direction this day. It is all the same. It is the same as I. Surely this lends us a familial bond of sorts. The smart move would be to travel as one, especially with the number of bandits in the area. You probably need the counterbalance of my intelligence as well. <laughs> no, and don't call me Shirley. <laughs> I should have guessed your, by your knuckle-dragging gait and minuscule nose. You're a complete and utter moron, aren't you? Um, let's take a look at that. No, actually, I am not. So, uh, don't make me slaughter you. Why are there chickens wandering around? So I guess that's the way to go into the city. But I'm too busy wandering around out here. So I guess that's a companion you can get. It's another companion I want to get. <clears throat> I mean, I know Khalid and Jahara aren't exactly the best companions you can get, but, uh, I don't know, I mean, I know that they're, they're kind of like the story characters, the ones that you're supposed, you know, canonically, although I don't think that the game is actually canon, um, they're the ones that you're supposed to have. Oh, interesting. Let's go in here. Uh, so that's one reason why I'm taking them. The other reason is just because I'm too lazy to look at all the others and figure out who's... Ooh. Are we going to actually see anything important? Not really. But it was a nice cinematic. Oh, there, wonder. Stay thy course a moment to indulge. How do we know it's Elminster? Good day to the. <coughs> Good day to the young one. What a marvelous happenstance that we should again cross paths, especially in such a grand city as this. Ah, I see by thine eyes that thou, thou have no time for my wry banter. Tis true, our meeting is, was no accident, though I do honestly take pleasure in seeing thee again. Yes, yes, let's anger Elminster. That would be awesome. It is good to see you again. What brings you here? Oh, all, this, all citizens of the Sword Coast eventually pass through Baldur's Gate, 
and I knew that knew thou wouldst as well. Forgive my count continued meddling, but I believe it is warranted, especially considering the pressures thou art no doubt confronting. My pestering thee certainly pales in comparison to the influence thou felt from others, including thine own self. Gryan raised thee as best he could, but tis hard indeed to overcome what, what is bred in the bone. Much more so in this case, I would imagine. What do you know of Gryan? He was long my friend, and we talked often, though less after he settled down with thee. He was quite the traveller in his day, though he never regretted his new role as foster father. He felt as he felt a stable childhood would be would better prepare thee for well, the problems that would eventually come. He cared deeply for thee. I hope I hope this was not lost on you. <laughs> bah Ryan was weak enough. He was a good man, though I would prefer to walk my own path. I was not suggesting thou should do otherwise. Whatever the motives, independence is always a wise course to follow. My worry is that thy lineage is harder to escape than most. Thou bad blood in thee, though Gorion did what he could to teach thee well and true. Thou hungry blood within thee as well, and it will not let thee go without a fight. For better or worse, what's bred in the What's bred in the bone will be dealt with in time. I trust thou the will to face it, face what is within thee. I know little of what is to come, but I will do what is best. I am sure the future will be kind to thee. For now I will give thee my best wishes and a few names that will serve thee well. Scar of the Flaming Fist is a good man, and well worth trusting. His superior, Duke Eltan, is also a good sort. Both are to be believed when they speak. I take my leave, and wish thee well. Oh, okay. Well, that's good to know. I don't have to worry about uh, Scar having, you know, lying to us or something like that. Beggar. Commoner. Commoner. Commoner, okay. I'm guessing this is going to be a commoner, too? Nobleman. Ah. I was wrong. Well, let's take a look at our map for a second. Okay, not much to do. It is done. Not much uh, visible. Let's see if there's anything uh, that we can. Ooh. Let's see what's in there. Nothing. Well, shucks. Commoner, commoner, cursed commoners! Give me named people. Those are the only ones I care about. It is done. Well, let's see if this guy has anything to interesting for sale. Are the best south of Waterdeep. Lucky Eye Yellow, huh? Hi, folks. Welcome to Lucky Eye Yellows, where the prices are so low there's gotta be something wrong. Nobody sells it lower than me because nobody buys it cheaper. So what are you, trying to be, like, the Walmart of, uh, um, Faerun? If so, can I kill you now? If you can find a price lower than mine, this side of Kalim Shan, the item will probably kill you. What can I get for you? <laughs> no thanks, you get what you pay for. Well, let's have a look. Potion of Perception. Uh, Antidote. Oh, I see. So I'm guessing that these are the, um... Cursed Scroll of Weakness. Wow. That... That is terrible. I'm gonna buy my cloak protection plus one. I'll do that. Buy those antidotes, though. All right, so I'm guessing that that oil of speed is uh, n not a good oil of speed. Yep, oh no! Wait, I've I've used those before, haven't I? Oh, 
Or have I? Let's take a look. I punch. Ah, okay. Cursed with confusion. Okay, well, good to know. It's a good thing that I've never used those. I wonder if I can sell those. What else is he selling? My prices are the best south of Waterdeep. So, a potion of perception that's kind of white, and a potion of healing that's red. So, that's what I need to look for. Okay. Cold resistance, this is the antidote. Potion of strength. Fortitude. Red Potion. Okay, I guess I don't have any of those others. I actually thought I did. Cursed with Lethargy. Interesting. I wonder what that does. Squeaky wheel gets the kick. Um, it's cursed, but it doesn't really say what it does. Maybe it just makes them tired faster or something. I don't know. I'm sure someone will tell me. I guess I'll just dump those two items, though. Then, although I should be able to sell them from sell them somewhere, I think. I'll have to figure out what to uh, put there in that other slot. Hmm. What would be a good... Uh potion for him. Wait, what was that one again? Here it is. What do I have again? Really use some of these potions sometime. <clears throat> eh, we'll play with that one. We'll see how badly that uh, kills me at some point. All right, let's find. See if we can it find a done. better shop to sell stuff at. It is so done. Maybe it'll uh, they'll buy it when he wouldn't. Although, somehow I doubt it. Are you just a commoner? Commoner. Ooh, hey. Who leaves money in a barrel? Seriously. Do, 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 do. Oh, look, there's a barrel here. I think I'll just put some coins in it. That's eh, locked. The door to this house is rotting off its hinges. You assume the house has been abandoned for years. It's really close to the entrance to town. Why would it be abandoned for years? It seems very strange. That's, that's also very strange. Nothing 
in there. Quarter sun. Commoner. Are you interested in some thrills, darling? Not really. I just wanted to see if I could uh, scare your uh, commoner away from uh, purchasing your wares, shall we say. Oh, can't go down there. There's a very narrow alley here. Woohoo! More barrels! That looks like a temple there. What's with the slowdown I'm getting? Ooh. What? I guess it became night? Okay. Interesting. Why is there a protection scroll in a... Let's identify it. And I can't, because I used up my spells and I didn't rest. Can you identify it? No. Can you identify it? No. You? Ah, oh, inventory full. Okay. Well, we'll figure it out later. <clears throat> I wonder if this is a house. Hi, friend. Hi there, what are you doing in this place? You better get out of here, unless of course you know the password. Password? Why would I need a password? What in the nine hells are you talking about? You're in the wrong place, fella. I'd get out while you're still able. I might not be able to stop a bunch of well-armed adventurers, but if you cause any trouble in the guild, I won't... Don't be expecting to walk out in one piece. Alright, fine, be that way. It is done. We will keep that in mind. Indeed. That must be the Thieves' Guild. Apparently they are just happy to uh, tell anyone who walks in to leave because it's the Thieves' Guild. Hi, friend. Apparently this is also the Thieves' Guild. Indeed. Or maybe they're just done. robbing the houses. I don't know. Here, stop a moment. I've got a word or two you need to hear. Yeah, stop a moment. I've got a word or two you need to hear. Ah, you're a fine group of mercenaries, are you? Leastwise, that's the word on the street. That you do the odd job here and there. I have a boss who'd like to have a word with you, if you can spare the time. We don't ask for free, though, and here'd be 50 gold just to hear him out. Fifty gold may get one ear, but I have another to support as well. Fifty gold just to listen? Eh, fair deal. Lead on. Wise choice of action. Now just follow me, and I'll show you the way to the guild. If you ask, the pa if you're asked the password, it's Farford. Really, really, not Swordfish. I'm disappointed. When you're in the guild, just look for the man named Al Al Alatos Ravenscar Thubild. Thubild. Okay. Okay. Which building are you going into? That one. Okay. Let's see what this is. Indeed. Hi, friend. Yeah, I know the password. Uh, it's... That's some interesting passwords there. Yeah, that's right, fella. Y'all can go in now. Go in where? Ooh. 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 Okay, so going where? Oh, there apparently. Eh, nothing good. You'd think that the thieves would keep their places, their chests and uh, drawers locked, but uh, apparently not. Ooh, hey, yeah, I'll take that.
Come on. Thank you. Certainly. Oh, it's locked. I bet that's locked too. Bet I can't get to it. Rogue. Alright, let's just go in. Are you just a rogue? You were just a rogue. Ah, you look different. Resar. Alatos. Welcome, my little friends. Welcome, my little friends. Please relax and keep your weapons at your sides. No need for hostility. I simply must apologize for the manner of my thieves. I suppose the thieves' guild must keep a measure of malice about it. But it does tend to put a cloud over introductions. I am Alatos Thubold. Though I th thank you not to mention that too often. You are Elmandretta, of course. Be not surprised. There are very few people in Baldur's Gate. I cannot name. I think you misspelled Baldur. I cannot name. You have been here for a f only a few days, and have already made quite a stir. I haven't even been here for a few days. Um. <laughs> no, I'll be. I'll be nice. Your interest in me is flattering, though I question your intent. Oh, I don't intend to flatter, merely to assure you that you have been watched since you entered the city. As for my intent, I do have a proposition for the for your group to consider. A small task, really. Best suited to someone unknown here. I'm quite sure that the membership of a thieves' guild would include several people capable of whatever you ask. Danger of being recognized seems a minor concern if one is able to not be seen at all. Why do you need me? And, of course, danger of being recognized seems a minor concern. Well, if I've been watched since I came in town and people know who I am, then uh, wouldn't that defeat the purpose? Shrewd, very shrewd. I do indeed have many fine individuals of exceptional skill, but a large number of them are vacationing at the garrison this season. Yes, it must be a lovely vacation spot this time of year. Indeed. The guard have been exceptionally vigilant, what with the banditry on the roads, and to their credit they have captured several of my best people. I am sure that, in the history of guilds, we are the first to experience a shortage of thieves. Uh, yeah, I kind of doubt that, actually. What exactly is it you would have me do? And what would be my reward for the service? How well can you afford to pay? <clears throat> it's quite the bit of intrigue, actually. A local wizard by the name of Chandelar makes his ho home in a moored Halruin skyship. It would appear that he has the knowledge to reproduce these flying marvels. All you need is a spell jamming helm, although that's not how they do it. It would appear that he has the knowledge to reap. Oh, that's what I said. And is currently organizing the sale of the recipe to Grand, Grand Duchess Leah Janath. He has drawn up a set of rituals and has procured an artifact fragment and an ancient statuette vital to the spell that keeps the ships aloft. These he has divided amongst his daughters until the deal is to proceed. I have been contacted by a representative of the Hal Ruins, and they have no wish to see scores of flying ships manufactured in every port. You are to infiltra infiltrate the place of exchange, steal the ingredients, and return here with them. Simple enough. You would be well paid, enough gold to give you a backache, and, if I am well pleased, mayhaps a magical weapon or two. Perhaps a little more, perhaps a little less. It entirely depends on your performance. <coughs> uh, doo -doo -doo. seems a fairly straightforward bit of Berkeley and well within my ability. I accept this challenge and hope it increases my standing within the guild. Uh, I don't know. I don't really like this option, though, either. Um, okay, whatever. As it should be, now that you have agreed, the facilities of the guild are at your disposal. Feel free to make use of them and make your presence known to the other members. You have my permission, so they will be less likely to kill you on sight. Oh, thanks! Less likely to kill me on sight. Fantastic. As for your mission, you have a 10-day to... Oh, crap. 
Informants have told me that the Duchess intends to take possession of the components that tenth day, and the exchange will be hosted by Oberon. Oberon? Oh. Will be hosted by Oberon at his estate. As I see it, you have several options. Directly persuade any of the involved parties to hand over the items, or burgle them out from under their noses. Good luck. Just kind of hoping for an open-ended thing that I wouldn't have to do if I didn't want to. Apologies, but you must die. What? I must die? What are you talking about? Don't bother me! Do you know who I am? I'm an envoy of the mighty nation of Halberua, and if you value your miserable life, you'll step away immediately. Mm, bite me. Alright, well, I think that Imwen is the best person to wander around here. So, go ahead and do that, Imwen. Yes, it is locked. We will fix... Ow! Bastard. I will take those. So I said daggers drawn with him, and he drops the Yeah, now, I know of you. New Steaksman you be, though I cannot see no need. Alatos needs but look at home for to find a dab at the thievery. Mayhaps we be testing your talent for your, uh, for your rank riders bungle the score. You up to me task? I have no idea what you just said. Do you speak common? <laughs> you be no thief if you can't speak the cant. You talk with Alatos before you get killed. Now hop, hop the twig and get thee hence, you jackanapes. Ah, so much fun. Who is this? Is this just a rogue? That is just a rogue. And I'm going to go ahead and heal you up, Imwen. And then I think we'll call it an episode, and uh, um, I'll pick it up in the next one as I continue to explore the Thieves' Guild. Hopefully not get killed by traps. See you then!